Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at the Nike SB Dunk Low Safari Olympics. Now this shoe here is part of a Nike pack that was released a couple of weeks ago. It was actually three sneakers. It was this Nike SB Dunk Low here. It was the Nike SB Blazer. And then I believe it was a Nike SB Janowski sneaker. And they all had somewhat similar color blocking. They had the light gray with the orange, black, and then the hit of teal on the laces. I think as of late, Nike SB has done a very good job with a lot of the Nike Dunk releases that have come out. And this one was no exception. I definitely love the entire upper of the shoe, the color blocking, just everything about it. And I knew I had to get them. I was actually shocked on how easy these were to get. I got these from a skate shop called Black Sheep Skate Shop. They're located in North Carolina and they were actually really easy to get. I paid retail for these and I believe currently at the time of the video, they're actually going for around retail, if not under. Whatever information I have, I'll be sure to link that in the description box below for you guys in case you guys are still interested in buying a pair of these. One thing I did love about this shoe is how similar it was to the Nike SB Dunk Low Safari that I released a couple of years ago. Obviously those had a little bit more of a orange hit on the toe box and on the side panels. But this one here, I just absolutely love how they implemented these teal laces. I just think it gives the shoe a little bit more of a pop overall. And they do come with an extra set of black laces in case you wanna definitely give it more of that subtle look. But I do love how these teal laces look with the shoe. But with that being said, guys, we're gonna take a quick look at these. So starting off with the outsole here, you have your standard Nike Dunk Low outsole here in all black. And then you have your Nike SB branding in the center here in like a burnt orange. As we continue on to the midsole here, we have your white midsole here with the black contrast stitching to kind of offset the other colors on the sneaker. As we move on to the upper here, we have a couple of things going on here. First and foremost, on the back panel and on the front panel here near the toe box, we kind of have like this polka dot leopard print material, which is mostly gray, but then the spots are like a dark gray or black which to me looks real nice and that is kind of like in a new buck material your mid panel here and your toe box are this nice new buck material in a light gray or a phantom i think is what the color on the box says and then you have more of that same color towards the eyelets as we look at the nike swoosh here it is made out of this nice soft black leather real great quality in my opinion and then you have more of that on the heel tab as well as we move towards the back here on the ankle liner, we have this nice black new buck material going throughout. As we move on to the laces here, as I previously mentioned, you got these nice aqua boot laces, which I absolutely love. I think it just gives the shoe a little bit of a pop. You have this smooth nylon black tongue here, and then you have your Nike SB branding in that burnt orange color. As we look at the sock liner, guys, we have more of that burnt orange. On the sock liner, you have your black insole and then you have your Nike SB and Zoom Air branding in burnt orange. One thing I did miss is the back of the shoe here. You have more of that Safari print. You can see more of this nice black nubuck throughout. You have your leather heel tab and then you have your Nike branding in that orange color. Here's a look at the black laces. Again, you can swap these out with the teal ones if the teal ones aren't for you. But personally, I love how the teal looks on this shoe. And that's pretty much it for these guys. Like I said, just wanted to give you guys a quick look at the Nike SB Dunk Low Safari Olympics. Again, this is part of a three sneaker pack. But to me, this one was definitely the best pair of the three. And honestly, I think I'm being a little bit biased because the Nike SB Dunk Low is one of my favorite sneaker silhouettes. So please keep that in mind when I'm talking about this pack here. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about these guys. Was this an easy cop for you guys? Was it an easy pass? Do you like this Safari colorway over the original one? Please let me know in the comment box below. Like I said, these aren't going for much over retail. If not, some pairs are going under retail depending on what size you wear. So I'll be sharing that information in the description box below for you guys if you guys are interested in buying a pair. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about these guys. Is this a nice shoe or not? 
Let me know what Nike SB Dunk Lows you guys are looking forward to in the next coming months. Definitely interested in seeing that in the comment box below as well. But like always guys, thanks for the support. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.